The May issue of School Administrator magazine delves into how unique methods of student testing and grading, adopted by educators during the pandemic, may become permanent practices. One story unpacks the positive impact portfolio defense has on students, teachers, and learning communities. So I've seen literally at this point hundreds of kids prepare for this kind of a presentation, and it's always very powerful for the student and very moving,、uh, as well as most importantly informative for the、um, adult educators that are that are working with students. Justin Wells heads up Envision Learning Partners, which works with an array of schools. He says student portfolios have become a popular practice to measure academic progress. Seeing is believing. It's 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 almost always very powerful for、uh, to to witness this kind of a presentation. It's not uncommon for witnesses to. Just be intensely impressed by the the poise and the and the preparation and the evidence on display of someone who's ready to move on to the next level, and it's not infrequent actually even to be moved to tears when you see students have a chance to to tell their story. Whether that's a student led conference for an elementary kid or a senior getting ready to move on to the next chapter of her life, they can be equally you know powerful. Wells provides several examples where school districts are building portfolio defense systems. His story also contains a few video links where educators can get a first-hand look at students giving their presentations. To read May's issue of School Administrator magazine on measuring student growth, visit the AASA website or join the conversation through social media. 